In this video, I will show you how to make the cinematic video in Premiere Pro or how to get the film look in Premiere Pro. Coming up. Hi everyone, I am Harshwardhan. Welcome to Harshwardhanart.com. In this video, I will show you how you can turn any video into cinematic video in Premiere Pro in 4 easy and simple steps. For this purpose, we need some assets and the download link for all the assets are in the description section below. And before we go any further, please hit the like button. If you are not subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing and please consider sharing this video with others. So having said that, let's get started. Step number one, add the cinematic bar or the film crop bar. Create a new adjustment layer by clicking on this icon and select adjustment layer and just press OK. Now click and drag and drop it on your timeline above your clips and just expand it up to the length of your clips. Now go to the effects. If it is not shown, go to windows and effects and just type crop and on the bottom here you will see the crop under the transform. Just click and drop it on the adjustment layer. Now go to the windows and select effects control. And over here just scroll down and find the FX called crop. And on the top type the number 8 and on the bottom just type the number 8 and that's it and now you can see bar is applied so let's see by rendering this sequence out or some portion of it go to the sequence render into out and now you can see this cinematic bar has been added to the clip just see this in full screen you already got the cinematic look and now right click and select this save preset and rename it as cinematic bars or crop whatever you would like to so that you can use it later on now this is available under your effects select presets and you can see over here in the effects and presets it's available cinematic bar or crop which we have just created so let's test it out select the adjustment layer click on the crop in the effects and control and delete that and now just click and drag this preset which we have just created and drop it over the adjustment layer and boom you can see immediately we have got these cinematic bars and cinematic look step number two color grade the video with cinematic LUTs download the 620 cinematic LUT preset the link is in the description section below and here we got all of these files after downloading now go back to the Premiere Pro Go to the Limetry Colors and apply whatever adjustment you want to on your basic clips. And then come to the Creative Panel. And from the look, just click on the Browse and browse the downloaded folder which we have just downloaded. Go to the LUTs folder and there we have the Cinematic folder. Inside these, choose any of these presets which you like. You can try different one which looks best on your footage or which you like. You can adjust this according to your own liking. And you can see the preview how it looks on your sequence let's browse something else and this one looks like this you can see the preview let's try a different one so try and test which looks best on your sequence you can even adjust the intensity if you want to you can lower down or increase the intensity of the LUTs preset after you have finalized the look you can even test how it looks with or without the LUT preset or the cinematic LUT preset by clicking on this eye icon or disabling the track to visibility by clicking on this eye icon let's test on this this is before and this is after let's test this on this one this was without and this is after we have applied the cinematic look Step number 3. Add these seamless transitions to your clips. Download the 2000 plus transition pack for Premiere Pro. Link is in the description section below. 
browse your favorite transition and apply it on your video clips by dragging and dropping over the clips. Do the same for all the clips in the sequence. Step number 4. Add Cinematic Track. Download the Cinematic Music Track from the link in the description section below. Just search the Cinematic and you will see lots of Cinematic Tracks over here. But I'll go for the Epic from the Yellow T. So this is the Epic Track from the Yellow T is the author. So just click on the Buy Now or Add to Cart. After the payment you can download this folder. And inside this folder, you will get lots of audio tracks. Some are short, some are longer. So go back to your Premiere Pro and add these into your or import these to your projects panel and open this folder, Epic folder. And this is and find this track Epic MP3 or Epic Wave, whichever you like. So click and drop this over your timeline. Now adjust its length according to the sequence. Let's shorten it and press Ctrl Shift D to apply the default audio transition that is fade in and fade out. Make any adjustments if you want according to your sequence. Now let's render this out. Press Ctrl M or Command M and select the format whichever you like. I go for H264 and either you can choose match high bitrate or you can go for YouTube 1080 full HD. This gives you the better quality. and. Then you can select the queue or you can simply export it from here as well. But I prefer to export it from the Adobe Media Encoded. This is the sequence which has been added to my queue. And just select the play button and you will see the preview. So this is how you can easily create this cinematic video in Premiere Pro in four simple steps. All the relevant links are in the description section below. If you want to download the cinematic bar preset, you can download, you can download the transition pack, you can download the LUT preset pack, you can download the audio tracks. All the links are in the description section below. And once it is completed, let's see how it looks finally. So thank you so much i hope you enjoy this video if you have any question do let me know in the comment section below and please hit the like button consider sharing this video and if you are not subscribed to this channel please consider subscribing so thank you so much bye bye see you in the next video